depression, frustration, anxiety, pain, dissolution. It's just a natural part in the process of becoming a stronger version of yourself. It happens to us spiritually and it happens in the world physically. Ask yourself what's blocking you? What's preventing you from acting? Why don't you have the courage to handle them? Why didn't you face that? What are you running away from? What kind of avoidance behavior are you engaged in? Courage is a way of life. It is as much as a habit as anything else. Like getting up and brushing your teeth in the morning or drinking coffee. It's a matter of routine more than anything else. People tend to speak courage only in terms of deeds. For an instance, they might speak of courage in a battlefield. Soldiers and policemen are supposed to show courage. Or they might refer to courage in the face of devastation, flood affected people, or earthquake victims must show courage. However, courage is not really the name you can give to you putting up with a bad situation. After all, in a bad situation, there's not much one can do expect cope with whatever strength and forbearance you can master. But though we didn't notice it, a lot of courage is part of our routines. The man who gets into a block sewer shows courage. The fucking man tills the land, not knowing whether he will have a good man soon, shows courage. The woman who resists the temptation to lavish goodies on her children shows courage. The child who breaks a leg on the football field but goes back to the game later shows courage. The student who is bent on following his dreams shows courage. The real test of courage is in our daily lives or should be. The courage to stand up for what we believe in. The courage to follow public rules and laws and insist that other people follow them too. The courage to resist those who take easy ways out, which only leads to more corruption and red tape in our social systems. be a page in your life, it might be a chapter in your life, but I think the book, baby, you're not finished writing yet. So I need to get busy living, do you hear me? To get busy living. There's still time as long as you can wake up in the morning, listen to me. You're still in the game, which means that you're in the game and there's still time in the game, still time left in the game. You can still win the game. You don't need courage to win. You need courage to fail. You don't afraid of winning, you're afraid of fail. And many times, you need to fail before you win. Fear doesn't go anywhere. You can't suppress it, just have a positive attitude. The fear is there. Acknowledge the fear. But courage is the strength that overrides all that fear to give you the strength to just try anyway. Do you need more courage in your life? Is there something that you haven't done yet just because you're a little too afraid? Are you afraid of going to a next level? In maybe a relationship or a business level of success? Or studying a new career? Yeah, it's, it's, it's hard, but it's okay. It's a journey of ups and downs. And in life, when you wanna live a life without limits, you need courage to try when you're afraid. Loving can hurt Loving can hurt sometimes But it's the only thing that I know 
when it gets hard You know it can get hard sometimes It is the only thing that makes us feel alive We keep this love in a photograph We make these memories for ourselves Where our eyes are never closing, our hearts are never broken, and time's forever frozen still. So you can keep me inside the pocket of your ripped jeans, holding me closer till our eyes meet, and you won't ever be alone. Loving can heal Loving can mend your soul And it's the only thing that I know, know I swear it will get easier Remember that with every piece of you mm -hmm. And it's the only That's when we die mm -hmm. We keep this love in a photograph We make these memories for ourselves Where our eyes are never closing Hearts were never broken Time's forever frozen still So you can keep Wait for me to come home